How's it going, everybody, and welcome back to the Lion's Den. And as always, my name is Jacob, and I'm here with my brother Aiden. Hello. And uh, what are we going to be doing today? We're going to be opening a Mega Ray Quaza collection box. Yes, that's what we're going to be doing. So we'll pause this video uh, real quick, and we'll get everything all set up for you, and with with the whole box on open or with the whole box opened up and everything. All right, we will see you soon. Bye. All right, everybody, we're back with everything unboxed, and we'll go ahead and get started with the uh, figure, and we'll check this bad boy out. So this is the Mega Rayquaza figure, and this one's actually pretty cool. Uh, this is probably one of the cooler ones that we've seen that we have um, now. It's I don't think it's our, our favorite one, but it's definitely the cooler looking one. How do you like this one, Aiden? Uh, I think it's really cool, especially because it kind of looks like lightning's coming out of him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Uh, we said I've said cool way too many times for this, but uh, yeah, it's interesting. It's a it's a nice little take. It would be kind of it would be kind of uh, awesome if it was the uh, shiny Rayquaza, but uh, the normal Rayquaza, Mega Rayquaza, is just as good. So we'll put that over there, and then we will look at our promo that we have here. And Aiden, if you would grab some sleeves. Definitely. And uh, we'll sleeve this guy up in just a minute, but we'll check him out. This is a nice looking hollow. It's got um, some cool little specs in it. Um, so it kind of gives a homage to the old hollows back in the day. Um, and then also it's got the ability Ozone Wall. As long as this Pokemon is on your bench, prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks. And then it's got Dragon Pulse. Discard the top three cards of your deck. Uh, but you do 130 damage. So that's pretty awesome. That's a, I mean, you do need two fire or lightning and a colorless. So you're going to have to run like multiple uh, diff uh, multiple energies in your deck. But it's still a pretty cool card. And that ozone wall is a killer ability to have. Especially if someone's got attacks that uh, affect on bench. Or also, or also a lot of <laughs> rainbow energies. Yeah, a lot of rainbow energies. Alright, so we'll go ahead and sleeve that bad boy up. And then we got our four packs here. It looks like we got uh, two Roaring Skies, uh, Phantom Forces, and a Primal Clash. So, I mean, it's pretty set up good. Yeah, so Roaring Skies in the back and the front. How about what if we do it like this? Yeah. Roaring Skies, Primal Clash, Roaring Skies, and Phantom Forces. Oh, and Double Dragon Energies. Double Dragon Energies because they can be colorless, yeah, yeah, if it's attached to a Dragon type. Yeah, that would be good for that Rayquaza. Yeah. But we'll go ahead and get started with this first pack. This is the... Uh, Glade pack art for the Roaring Skies, and that's mega? actually me this is Mega Glade. I think so because it has like this. Oh yeah, I think they're all Megas. Yeah, so it's got to be Mega Glade. All right, we'll open this bad boy up. And for these packs, we are not going to be giving the code cards away, just because we're a little low on. Uh, we're a little low on uh, Roaring Sky, or like the lower uh, base set. Uh, at, X and Y's, yeah, the or older packs from X and Y were a little low on, so we're going to uh, keep them for now, just for these ones. But the next one we do, I promise you, we will give the codes away. Unless it's a Generations, then we won't. But if it's anything but a Generations, we will give that away. All right, now we do we did the pack trick here, and we will check out what we have. All right, we got a Ninkata for our first card. Got a Swablu for another common. Voltorb. Togepi. Shuppet, which I think I've made a comment before about this, but I, I, I like this design of the Shuppet. That's like little, they're I hanging know. off of the the uh, the roof there. That's pretty cool. And we got Sil uh, Silcoon to go with, do we get the, oh, I thought we had a Wormpole. No. Uh, for our Uncommon. Ooh, nice, a Steven. This is actually a really good supporter to have in a deck. Um, it's search your deck for a supporter card and a basic energy card. Re reveal them and put them into your hand. Shuffle your deck afterwards. So it's basically giving you another supporter and a free energy with it. So that's a really, these are really good to have. And actually, Aiden, don't you have a full art of this guy? Yes, and, and I believe that's like 12 bucks. Yeah, but these are, this, this Steven's always a good supporter to get. All right, then we got a Gallade Spirit Link. Is that a sign? It was in the Gallade pack art, Gallade Spirit Link. Will we get a, a Gallade Mega, a Mega Gallade? We'll Hopefully. see. Then we got the Reverse Hollow Execute with the nice Leaf Energy. And then for our rare, we have a... Oh my god, what? A full art Wally. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. A full art Wally. 
Isn't that one of the rare? Oh my god! I have not seen a full art Wally yet. I don't know if it's all like full art trainers are pretty rare. Like that is a oh my goodness! And let's check out the back here. Pretty, pretty good condition. I don't really see any specs in it or anything. There's a little bit of damage on each corner or in a little bit of the corners, but wow, a full art Wally. That is amazing. Definitely sleeve that one up. That is a great pull for our first pull. And hopefully these cards can live up to the expectations that we've already set here. Maybe oh my goodness. Me. We'll definitely check out the prices on the Full Art Wally. And maybe we'll make a video of our like Full Arts, our Secret Rares, and AXs that we have. And we'll kind of like go over what we have and see, like show the prices and what. And like maybe I'll make a video later of like. Uh, how you can kind of tell what a price of a card is going to be because i think a gen generally a full art card is going to be worth uh if it's full art it's going to be worth like over $15 um mm -hmm. and uh whatever it is but it and then also depends on if it's a mega or an ex and stuff like that but we'll get on with our next set oh look we got the nidoran female that's cute Trap inch. Oh, and this was the Mega Agron. This was the Primal Clash. Sphiel. Torchic. Then we got a Meryl, which is like the the first time Meryl became fairy, I believe, was in this set. I don't 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 trust me on that. I th this it's the first time I've seen Meryl as a fairy, is what I should say. Then we got Archie's Ace in the Hole, which is a decent um supporter card for waters. It says you can play this card only when the, it's the last card in your hand. Put a Pokemon, uh, put water Pokemon from your discard pile onto your bench, then draw five cards, or put a water Pokemon, um, which is a pretty like if you get it, it's a really good card to have. But you got to make sure you get it the last card Does in your it hand. Say basic water Pokemon. Um, no, it doesn't. So you can like put. Any yeah, it's water any. Pokemon. So you can put a Mega on if you want to, and you don't need the pre-evolution of the Mega. And that's pretty good. Yeah. All right, then we got a uh, by barrel. Is that how you say his name? Bibber, Bibber, oh. whatever. But he's the uh, the uh, um, beaver Pokemon, you know, in the evolution of Bidoof. That's our uncommon. Ooh, nice scorched earth, which is a good stadium to have for uh, fire and uh, fighting. Then you have a reverse Cedra, which is really really cool. The water energy is actually pretty cool. Um, and then for our rare, we got a nine tails. All right. Well, that's just a regular rare, but that is still a good nine tails. This is actually, I use this nine tails in one of my decks. Um, it's, uh, his ability is pretty good. The barrier, barrier shrine. Each player can't play any stadium cards from his or her hand. So that's a pretty good card to have. If you're trying to keep the stadium card, like we had scorched earth, if you wanted to keep that there, um, on your, as a stadium card, you play this put person down or play this uh, Nine Tails down on your bench, or it being your active doesn't matter. And then uh, Flickering Flames is a good attack too, because uh, the active Pokemon opponent's Pokemon is asleep right after uh, attacking. So that's actually pretty good for for just regular play. N not an ultra like we were hoping, but we already pulled a pretty amazing um, ultra. All right, now we'll go with our second Roaring Skies here. And again, sorry that we're not giving out the codes. Um, we do, you know, we kind of want to keep them just because we've been giving out a lot of codes lately and we kind of want to uh, keep them for ourselves for now. Um, for just a, for just this one, since they are, it's, it is a kind of older set. Yeah. Hold on. I think I messed up the pack trick a little bit, but That's fine. I think our reverse rare is going to be um, one step closer than it should be. Um, our, and our first card is going to be a Pikachu. Wow, that is a cute Pikachu right there. I think I've, we've seen this one before, but it's still a cute. Pikachu is always changing, so it's uh, cool to see the evolutions, so to speak, uh, or the different types per generation they do. Um, Natu. Natu, yeah, Spiro. Voltorb, Inke, Electrode, that's our first uncommon. Oh, it's told you there. We got a reverse Electrode. <laughs> that's funny. That's funny. Um, then we got a Magnetric, and then 
Oh, I was too I was too off, I guess. A Mega Turbo, That's which crazy. is a great card to have. These are always good to have in Mega decks because you can bring a, a basic energy from a uh, card from your discard pile on, uh, to one of your Mega that. Evolution Pokemon, yeah. And then our Articuno for a regular rare. Wow. And this is actually a good, another good regular rare, a good playable one. It's got Find Ice, which is you search your deck for up to three energy cards, reveal them, and put them into your hand, and then shuffle your deck afterwards, and then Freezing Win for 100 damage. And then plus, it's a legendary bird, so it's always cool to have that. Yeah, Zapdos is better. Oh, I like Articuno. What are you talking about? Zapdos is cool too, though, I guess. <laughs> All right, our last pack here. Um, now we... Well, uh, I forgot what I was going to say. Well, hopefully we can get something from this, from the Phantom Forces. I think last time... Uh, last time we... Uh, opened up a fan, the Magnetric Phantom Forces, I think we got a... Got a good pull from it. I can't remember what it was, but um, hopefully this one will be the same. Give me, give us something real good. All right, so we'll flip this bad boy over. We got a Litwick for our first card. Wow, there's the Psychic Litwick. I actually had a deck with a uh, Chandelure Litwick in uh, what is it? Uh, Lampet. Lampet, and it was a pretty, it, it's a pretty pretty good deck to to work with. Uh, you know what I want to see in the Dene? Alola? Yeah. A yeah, what? A mega de Dene. I mean, I just thought I just think it'd be funny. <laughs> All a mola, Skarmory. Yeah, it'd be pretty cool. That's a common, right? Yeah. Bunnelby. That's a cute Bunnelby. Um, not the not the good Bunnelby to have right now, but it's it's still a pretty cute looking guy right there. And we got a. Is it zero zero six? I think zero six. I don't know. I've seen a I've seen his full art version of this, and it's actually pretty cool. And it's a choose a Poke Tool or special energy card attached to a Pokemon in play and discard it. So that's a pretty decent card to have if someone's running like a Spirit Link and they haven't evolved yet. or mm -hmm. uh, And you can get rid of their Spirit Link. Or um, I know with a Garbodor right now in one of my decks, if you have a tool attached to them, uh, attached to them, every other Pokemon's abilities is canceled out. So you can use this to get rid of that. Except for Garbodors. Except for Garbodors, yeah. And then we got a Furfru for another uncommon. We got a Firo. We got a Reverse Hollow Wobbuffet. Wow. <laughs> I actually ran used this Wobbuffet in one of my decks before. Uh, I would have preferred to have this Reverse Hollow because it's way cooler. But it's it can it can do quite a bit of damage because of its um, Psychic Assault. This attack does 10 more damage for each damage counter on your opponent's active Pokemon. So if they had like 5 damage counters on them... It would do 10 damage for each, so it would do 100 damage total. Oh, it's 10 plus. It would do yeah. 110. Yeah. That's uh, like a Which is really good to have. Alakazam, but it's still yeah, good. it's still pretty good, and it's, you know, a basic. All right, and for our rare card, we got a... Oh, my God! A full art Magnetrek EX. Oh, my God. I couldn't ask for better. Wow. From the Mega Magnetric Phantom Forces pack, we got the full art, shiny shine, Magnetric EX. And we got a Magnetric, so that was a good oh, thing. Oh my. This one. It was from the last one. Manectric. Is it Manectric or Magnetric? Mm -hmm. Manectric, Man. same. Yeah. Oh. Wow. It's not Magnetric, it's Manectric. But, uh,. Wow, that's amazing. All right, if you want to sleeve that up real quick. If it was magnetic, that now, would make sense because electricity is magnets, mm -hmm. stuff like that. Gosh, and we will get our, um, put our commons here, uncommons here. Grab our, we'll get everything set up for our uh, recap. And First off, we'll go with the with the uh, slow stuff, the stuff that's not um, that's not too important. Then we'll come back with our awesome pulls that we got. So first, we got of course we got the Glade Spirit Link, which is good for a Mega. The Mega Turbo, which is also good for a Mega. Scorch Earth, we talked about, is good for fighting and uh, fire. fire. Then Zero Sick or Zero Sick, however you say that. Which is another good supporter to have. We talked about Archie and Archie's uh, 
Archie's Ace in the Hole, Steven. And then we also got our regular rares here, the Legendary Bird Articuno and the Ninetales. And then for our final two our final cards right here. Oh yeah, of course we got our our we got our um figure as well, which is amazing. And then we got a our promo. I couldn't think of the word for a minute. Our promo, our nice Rayquaza, which is another legendary animal to have. So that's awesome. Or is he mythical? He's I don't. Legendary. He's legendary. Yeah, he's not mythical. But yeah, here's our another legendary dragon. Then we got our full art supporter card, Wally. Oh, and I also forgot to talk about what he does. Basically, you search your deck for a card that evolves from the Pokemon you current, a Pokemon on your bench or or your active Pokemon, excluding any X, and uh, you put that on, and it, it counts as your evolution. But wow, it's a full art Wally. That's amazing. And then we also pulled our full art Magnetric EX, or Manetric, whatever, however you may say it. But those are two amazing pulls from this. I wasn't expecting this at all. I wasn't expecting to pull a full art at all. Maybe an EX, maybe a... A uh, break. I don't. They had breaks in this, right? No, it's no. Breakable. That's that's one break. Break. Or yeah, maybe. You know, I was thinking an EX, maybe a full art, but not two. Holy moly! That was well. Good. We'll set those guys right here. And as always, guys, please, if you can, like, comment, subscribe, uh, share this out to whoever you can. Uh, mention us. Um, again, comments do really, really help with us. We really like to know how our situation is, how you like the lighting, um, how our audio sounds, uh, what we can do to make this better, and what kind of success you've had um, if you are, are you are a YouTube channel as well. Um, yeah, and please, uh, please again, like, uh, favorite, share, and um, hope, hopefully you guys are going to get some good polls like we did from uh, different sets. Uh, I wish you guys all the best. You guys have a great day. Stay fancy. As always, like he's, like Aiden said, stay fancy. And uh, join, join the pride if you can. Become a subscriber. And peace out. Have a great day, guys. Bye.